Okay, so today you are going to practice reading a Venn diagram, which is what this is called. This whole thing, pick this whole picture, is called a Venn diagram. So we have three categories, tennis, sailing, and Batman. Batman is going to be for this circle. Sailing is going to be for this circle. And tennis is going to be for this circle. Okay, so if it's, so let's look at badminton first. Anything on this outside circle is just going to be for badminton. Okay, so there are 18 people who like badminton. Okay, 18 people who like badminton. Now, if we were to look on um, this circle right here, this part, this would tell us. Since it's in between badminton and sailing, we have 20 people who like badminton and sailing. They like both of those things, okay? If we were to look at this circle, it is in between badminton and tennis. So this tells us that there is 21 people that like that like badminton and tennis, both things, okay? If we were to look at this middle circle right here in the very middle, it has a little bit of all three circles. So there are 13 people who like badminton, sailing, and tennis, okay? They like all of the above, all of them. If we look at sailing over here, this circle way over here. This circle only is for sailing. So we have two people, two people who like sailing, okay? If we were to look at this one, we have eight people, and I'm getting the number from inside the circle, okay? We have eight people who like sailing, and tennis, both things, because they share both of those circles, okay? Now, if we were to look at this circle down here at the bottom, we have six people who only like tennis. They only like tennis. They don't like nothing else. They only like tennis, okay? Remember, if they're in this circle, they like badminton and sailing. They share both of those circles. 21 people like badminton and sailing. If this circle, we have 20 people who like badminton and sailing. Oops, I told you wrong. 21 people who ba like badminton and tennis. I'm so sorry. Tennis, because tennis is right here. Okay, whatever is on the outside of the circle, that's, the, that's what they like. Okay, now we also have... I don't know if you've if you've seen it by now, but we have this four that's way out here. It's not in any of our circles. So this means we have four people who do not like any of this. They don't like badminton, they don't like sailing, and they don't like tennis. We have four people who don't like any of those things. Okay, so we have them way out here by themselves. Okay, remember if it's in the very middle like this, they like all three categories. They like badminton, sailing, and tennis, all three of them. Okay, so if you had a question that says, how many students only like sailing, you're gonna look on this outside circle and we have two students who only like sailing. Okay, if you have a, a question that says, how many students do not like both badmat badminton and sailing, so they don't like both of those things, we're going to look at a circle that doesn't have sailing and doesn't have badminton. So we only have six people who do not like badminton sailing. Okay. Um, let's do another one. So if you have a question that says how many students do not like both sailing and tennis. So we're not going to look at sailing and we're not going to look at tennis. We have 18 students who only like badminton. Okay, if you need help, let me know.